What is up, you bunch of savages? Savage Mister here, and I'm at Six Flags. So once again, let's get in here and just have a look at the uh, scary zones. Watch people get scared, and I guess I'll hit some haunts as well. And holy mackerel, those lights are bright. Look at that thing, bro. Dude, the lights are so bright you can't actually see the thing. It's not like they have the thing shined on the uh, haunty bit there. It just bl blows it out where you can't even see it. You see it from that side, my gosh. But anyway, let's get in here and see what's doing. See the hoodie? Yes, it's actually chilly. We woke up to 45 degrees this morning or something. The feel like was like 35 or 36. And as I make my way inside here, let me take this time to remind you, if you are new here and uh, you like the Six Flags stuff, you like the Fright Fest stuff, whatever it is, please consider subscribing and you can become a savage, yeah. There's some creepiness right there. That dude's a savage right there. Oh yeah. This is the guy that uh, was talking that time. Although I must warn you, you must be careful not to become one of the trees. <laughs> <laughs> with the voice now that it's really dark you can see all the lovely lights and stuff like that I like the lighting here as well creepy looking lights while you're purchasing your stuff but I still like looking at this this is really nice how the lights they change and stuff it's pretty cool pretty cool all right let's get in here I don't know if I do want to go in here this is gonna be scary bro it says the scariest fright fest ever dang read that read the warnings Oh my lordy, let's go see if it's true. Dude, this line is not moving at all. This is one of those times when it's best to just go over there. So screw it, that's where I'm going. I made it into Creepland. Oh my, they got the WBAT radio thing going on over there. That's pretty nice. Yep. All right, let's go around here and get my wristband. It's not too bad, but there's a little bit of a line. Dang, dude. All right, I was going to wait in line there, but I think the uh, dining pass has been extended to 9 during Fright Fest, and it's like 8.45, so... Got 15 minutes to get some food. Let me go grab some quick food, then I'll come back and get my wristbands. Let's go through the Freak Town Scare Zone on my way to get some food. How about that? Yeah, let's see what we got. Let's see if we got some creepers. Yeah. Freak Town. Creepers. We like the lighting here as well. So we got some lighting up there, shining down, making the ground look all lovely. Pretty nice. It looks pretty good, people. Oh, that's great. And I got my food. So, let me go eat. I know what you gotta do. You gotta shut up. Uh, you gotta shut up. Hee <laughs> hee. Alright, are y'all finished shutting up? Did y'all successfully shut up? I'm finished eating. I'm gonna go through, uh, back through the uh, creepy town, freak town, whatever it's called, and uh, go get my wristbands for the haunts. Dang it! Looking extra creepy. Let's go check it out. <laughs> People trying to escape. It's... <laughs> you! Me again! Why are you invading my personal space? It's you again! <laughs> 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 it's nice and foggy. <coughs> oh my lordy. Oh, somebody done got got. We survived it. We made it through. All right. Wristbands. Boom. We were like getting. All right, on my way back here to get my uh, wristband. I just met Norman in the family. I'm sorry I didn't pull out the camera and put y'all on, but uh, it was good to meet y'all. I'm glad y'all said hello. It was really cool. Dude, looks like I timed that perfectly. I'm glad I go, went to go eat. Look at this. Not much of a line now. And this is just eerie. There's, It's like the Bugs Bunny Boom Town closed, but the lights are still on, and you can hear this creepy music playing and sounds. Dude, that's eerie. 
when coming across the bridge, it's eerie to see the railroad tracks. You can see them in the light a bit, and then they just go to nowhere. Oh my goodness. All right, now that I'm all strapped up and I've already gone through that thing twice, bye, there they are. I was just like, I was just saying that, hey, uh, I didn't put them on camera, but hey, Norman's family, you know, and here they are. They showed up again. Now quit stalking me. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm gonna go get scared. You, you were gonna be here. Oh yeah. Oh, We're about to do some kind of a challenge here. These guys have got to dance or something. Out? Oh yes. Uh, now are you ready? So cool. Yes. Yes. Here we go. <laughs> All right then. Here we go. Three, two, one. Yeah. Oh, right. <laughs> Let's watch these guys humiliate themselves. <laughs> hey! Oh! He's covered his face now. Oh, bro. Oh, my. Oh, <laughs> Alright, that's funny. What do you think about that? So as you know, here I am on a Friday night, not a Saturday or a Sunday. And then it's open this Monday because of uh, Columbus Day. By the time you see this, it might be below Columbus Day, I don't know. But, uh, uh, so yeah, crowds aren't too bad. And if you can make it out on a Friday instead of a Saturday, because everybody comes out on Saturday. If you come out on Friday, it's perfect because most everybody else in Texas, they're at a football game, high school football. So come on out. I know I said come on out, but maybe not all of you. That way we can keep the crowds low. <laughs> if you all come out, then it's going to be as bad as Saturday, isn't it? But here's the piggies exit. And look who I see coming out of the exit. Is this a pretty good house? <laughs> Hey, it's that guy again. The guy that keeps staring my freaking hair, dude. The guy. He's hiding it. Same, yeah. It's getting long. Oh, it's so long. I'm a hippie. I bet with the wind, it's in your face, isn't it? Yeah. Face your fears. Cody! Let's go. They, they can't answer you. No, they can't. No, in the comments. Oh, yeah. How are you going? Oh, dude. Alright, we survived the piggies. We're gonna go through the uh, squeal on pig scare zone. Let's see what it looks like. Dude, I love the lighting. Check that out. Dude, that is awesome. Just the way that looks. Tell me that's not epic looking. For real. It's epic. There's some creepers. There's some creepers. He got one. Like, I just want to get through, man. Dude, it looks like a dang Hollywood horror movie set, for real. It's gonna run into somebody because it's all the dang with all the uh, fog and stuff. Uh oh, I lost them. All right, the group is going on to uh, Arania's. I'll check that out another night. I, did, I don't have enough battery, I don't think. So, uh, yeah, let's go. Whoa, there we go. I love when people are running full speed, it's great. Like that. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's look around here some more and see what we can capture. Let's move over here by the side and see what we can see. Because I just love the way this looks, man. The aesthetics are gorgeous. Really awesome. We got a piggy. These guys are afraid. They're afraid to even come over by the piggy person. All right, we're over here by the... Uh, You'll see me Sam Gold River Adventure that's defunct. And the art of torture is right there. Let's see what the line looks like. Ooh, looks like not much line at all. Let's go in there and check out the art of torture. Might as well do, right? Let's go check it out. Before I go in, let's admire all the lovely lighting that they have over here. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Post items and aliens and That was the art of torture, y'all. It was pretty artful and pretty torturous. I don't know, but uh, oh, they've actually letting people up, dude. They're actually going up. I want to go up and see the park from up there, dude. Let's just see if I can get on. That's what I want to do. Let's go do it. They got this thing where you sign up for the Yeti. Whenever the Yeti people are not here doing their thing, they should have creeper zombies 
or like some kind of a creeper standing there with clipboards and come up to you and kind of like you know like you're gonna and then maybe have like a severed finger as a pen to write with or something he 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 all right if this thing is open it's gonna be quite yep it's open it's gonna be quite nippy but let's go up and check it out i haven't done that yet at night during fright fest so let's go check it out you're gonna not see it here you're gonna see it in, the, in another video I'll, I'll post. Now I'm over here by the Curse of Ra. Might as well go in because there's not a line at all. Back here at the exits of each of the these haunts, they have the old uh, stunt show stuff here. Pretty cool. High pitched clowns over here now. Or if you're running that tasty little treat. Go down to Piggy's Bloodshed. However, be careful. Because some of the guests be called the treat. Make sure that does not happen to you. We have a Alright, let's go through the voodoo swamp. Yeah. Let's see what it's like tonight, folks. They got the lights on. Yay. Oh, it looks good over here. I love it. It's beautiful. Uh oh. oh huh? I love the lights, y'all. Really nice. Oh, there's creepers everywhere. Creepers. Oh, I think they got me. They're gonna get me, y'all. Come and help me. Oh, shake a shake a shake a Jeez. Yeah, the lighting, I love it. And these lights aren't on tonight. Over there they are, but at least they're kind of back and there's trees kind of blocking a little bit. Because when those lights were on at the uh, thing, dude, it just kind of blew this out, but it looks really nice. Oh, here comes some new meat. Let's go. How sweet, fresh meat. Good luck. Dude, there's a lot of fresh meat coming on right now. There we go. <laughs> we got one turning around. She's like, nope, I'm not going through. Oh, here we go. Yes, they detect the fresh meat. I love it. <laughs> All right, we're coming into Got Ham and such. So, straight away, somebody's getting this creeped on. Well, let's find some sliders. She's not a slider. Oh, there's one. There's two. I think they're. I think they're pooped. And they're watching. Uh, oh, there's another one. They're just kind of resting. They're resting. Let's go check out Hell Block Six. Sentenced to death. And all that jazz. Let's go. Let's go. Let's have a fun time. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. I survived. I survived Hell Block Six once again. I got sentenced. I was guilty, I had to go, and at the end, I ended up going through hell, and I came out of hell to talk about it. How about that? We got some savages down here, they're going to meet us at the, at the exit. Let's, let's say hey to them at the exit. Here's a little future savage that went through with me. He was pretty hardcore, man. He had it covered. I love it. Solid dude, man. So here we are, man. This, what's your name again? Asher. Asher, yeah. So Asher's like... I don't want to go through no hell blocks, so I'm like, I'm not one of those that'll push you. I will say, once you get through it, tell him, y'all, in the comments, say, yeah, you can do it. And this guy thinks I've got three subscribers. Huh? Uh, come on, be the fourth, you. <laughs> all right, come on. All right, y'all, that's all I've got time for. I pretty much did it all. So, I'm gonna go and say bye for y'all, to y'all from here. And see y'all in the next one. Y'all stay savage.